Making the announcement at the Sports Commission's office was the Chief Administrator, Freddie Mwea, who explained that today was the last day for federations to submit their entries for this year's sport categorization. Mwea stated that his office issued a request for categorization to the federations last month and a meeting was held to guide the process. We are looking that in a period of two weeks we are going to complete this exercise, submit to the board for their recommendation to the office of the minister for approval, and we are going to announce you know, to which category do you find yourself as a sport court. We've got four sports courts that just joined last year, like that Association of Namibia, Multi Association of Namibia, you know, Pool Association of Namibia. So those are some of the sports courts when you look at them. Obviously, when you're a new sports coach, that guy is on board. Uh, there's no need for us to really put a very strict measures because you are still starting and you are still growing sports coach. Muya urged federations who have not submitted their entries to do so by Friday as an extension will be granted for the next three days. He also stated that the Ministry of Sports, Youth and National Service has availed two officials who will help conduct the process when the due date extension lapses. The second phase of the process will run for the next four years after the first phase which started in 2018 expired in 2022. When asked about the conflict between the current executives and the concerned group in boxing, he said that the two will be addressed this week. From what we could actually observe is there is a need for us to have a meeting with them. So they will be having a meeting the day after tomorrow on Thursday at 11 o'clock. All the two groups will be at one table. What I would like to emphasize is we have sanctioned their trial that will take place from the 22nd to the 25th of this month because they have to select a national team squad. Because this squad have to train for at least 12 months to ensure that we have got a very winning team when we go to the African Games next year in Ghana and also for other international games that are going to participate this year. So we call upon all regions to take note that the trials will take place sanctioned by the Sports Commission he made it clear that issues of such magnitude will not be condoned because it is affecting athletes' progression. In order to avoid similar conflicts in future, a training program will also be offered to govern different sport codes. Nicholas Theremo, NBC Sport News, Ventuk.